Hi, I'm Patrick Hughes, the founder and CEO of Inclusion Solutions. This year, as of March 15th, 2012, the new ADA regulations came into effect. And we've seen a lot of our customers and people in the marketplace confused and not really sure how to address this. Should you spend thousands of dollars on consultants? Should you renovate and retrofit all of your pumps? We think there's another way of doing that. It's called fuel call. Our fuel call system is cost effective and actually solves the problem of the communication for what happens when a customer with disabilities pulls up to your pump. Let's take a minute to look at our system and how it could impact your business and possibly even add more to the bottom line. So reviewing the law again, the ADA requires that when there's more than one employee on duty, you're required to come out and pump gas. So the drivers will prove this by a hang tag or a permanent license plate. We sort of look at two different user groups within the disability community uh, as it relates to drivers with disabilities. One is those who can pump their gas and the other one is those who can't. Uh, those who can pump their gas, a lot of the new regulations help. Uh, lowered credit cards, a lot, of, a lot of the measurements impact those who can. What it doesn't necessarily address is those who struggle getting gas and can't. I'm just going to talk to you about some of the things that go on for those drivers. Um, a lot of times they getting out of their vehicle can cost can take seven, eight, ten minutes to get out of their vehicle. And what's happening for you uh, is that they're clogging up your, your lanes and your traffic. Um, plus it, there's a safety issue for them as well, getting out of putting their lift down in the middle of traffic. Um, the next is signage. A lot of times when we pull in, the signage is doesn't work. Uh, horn honking has proven not to not to be in a very effective uh, tool. Although a lot of the settlements in, in some of these larger lawsuits have recommend horn honking, uh, it doesn't work. Um, most of the employees are very unclear as to what each horn honk actually means. So it's not a very um, it's not dignified from the consumer side, but it's also not a very effective uh, communication tool for, for a business. Um, so then the next is, if there is an intercom, oftentimes they're way out of reach, so we can't even reach them from the vehicle. Um, that includes the touch screens. So most of the touch pads are out of reach. I'm in a mid-sized vehicle, and I'm going to struggle reaching this, and I have full, full use of my upper extremities, and I'm going to struggle you know, asking for help from my vehicle here. Um, if the if the if the customer is able to get out and pump their gas, sometimes they struggle with getting their gas caps off, and then also their nozzles. Um, so there's just a lot of things that I think a lot of us don't think about or know about in uh, when we're thinking about this customer base. Um, so providing a dignified and practical solution uh, to solving this is good for your customers. It's good for your employees and. We think it'll bring more business to you. So, so let's just talk about the pump heights here for a second. If your business was, if your gas station was built before March of this year, 2012, everything is supposed to be below 54 inches from the driveway surface. So let's measure that and see how this one holds up. So everything, as you can see here, here's 54 inches. Most of the operable parts, at least on this touch pad, are well above that. So this gas station has some issues. Here is our solution for the, for the ADA as it relates to your gas station. It starts with the roadside sign so that the customer pulling in now knows there's a solution here at this gas station. Our sign, our tagline says ensuring refueling assistance at the pump, which means that the consumer and the employee are both clear that there's a plan here at this gas station. The ADA regulations ask for you to post signage to let people know which island is the accessible island. In our fuel call kit, you'll see that our fuel call system comes with a sign letting you know this island is the accessible island. So now the car has pulled up into the island because now they know which island is the accessible island to come to because of the signage uh, and the clear plan. Now they pull up, they see the hours of service. This tells them when there's more than one employee on duty so at this station, it's 6 in the morning till 9 at night. So customers pull in, they know at this time they're going to be able to get gas in their car. All they then simply do is push the oversized call button. It's mounted right at 48 inches to the center of this button, which is kind of the center point between a van and a lower, smaller car. Um, wirelessly rings inside. The, the attendant now knows, because it's a dedicated call system, that this customer needs assistance at pump 14. And 
they come out and pump their gas. It's that simple. As an alternative, for some people, they still might not be able to reach this from their vehicle, even though it's protruding off the island quite a bit. Uh, so we post the local phone number of the, of the C-Store right here, just as an alternative. We don't like this as a primary because that's putting the burden of responsibility back on the consumer to carry a cell phone with them. And for a lot of reasons, we don't want to have cell phones out at gas stations. So once you've installed our fuel call system, we'll then add you to our database at fuelcall.net so that 15 million drivers with disabilities in the U.S. will actually be able to navigate to your station to know when and how they're going to get their gas pump. Now that you've seen our system, we think you have four things to consider. One, you could still do nothing, but we think you have legal exposure if you do nothing. Two, you could hire expensive consultants, but even after hiring these consultants, you're still going to have to do something after whatever they tell you to do. Three, you could retrofit your pumps, but even retrofitting the pumps doesn't necessarily solve the communication issue uh, from people being able to get assistance from their vehicle. And four, we think if you implemented fuel call system, not only will you legally solve your problem, but you'll actually add more business to your bottom line. Thank you. If you're interested, contact, contact us on our website at inclusionsolutions.com or call us toll-free at 866-232-5487. Thank you.